It's Nat and Essie plus Sprinkles the Bear. <laughs> oh, Mickey, would you like to see some magic today? Magic? I want to see magic every day. Well, 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 brace yourself because Wizard Nat is here to make us disappear. Wait, what? Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Minnie Mouse, Daisy Duck, I guess they really did disappear. Oh, that was amazing. But now how do I get them back? Uh-oh. I think we're going to need another magic to do that. Besties? Essie, can you help me? Hello, hello there, besties. Essie here for Nat and Essie. And hello to you, Mickey. I see you lost your friends there. Oh, I sure did. But I figure you probably know how to get them back, right? Huh? We create them? That sure sounds like fun. Let's do it. We have a blue dough, purple, yellow, and pink dough. There's also a smaller white dough and another shade of pink dough. We have a bow mold, a Minnie Mouse head mold. There's also a yellow rolling pin with some bows and heart designs. A knife that doubles as molds. And of course, a daisy duck mold and a Minnie Mouse mold. Let's start off by making Minnie Mouse. So here is her mold. I have here some purple Play-Doh. We are going to put that on the bow area, just like that. For the body, I was gonna use this pink Play-Doh, but check this out. Oh no, it is hard. <laughs> There's no way we can use that one, but no worries. I have my very own Play-Doh that's also color pink. So let's get that. And we are going to use that for Minnie's body. She has gloved hands, so I wanna put some white Play-Doh on there. But just like the pink dough, this one is also hard as rock. But no worries, I have my very own Play-Doh that we can use. Let's put that here and here. And then let's put more purple dough for the dress area and also for her shoes. And then we'll get more pink Play-Doh. I know it kind of looks weird right now, but I'm hoping that it will work. Let's close this up and press it on. Let's take out all the excess and now we open it up. Okay, that's the back, don't worry. I'm hoping the front will look so much better. Ta-da! Oh look, that is not bad at all. <laughs> so I like this one, but I wanna see if we can do it again and maybe we can create something a little better. Ta-da! Okay, so here is the first one that we did, and then here is the second one. I think I like the second one better, so we'll keep this one. I love it. Okay, now let's get our daisy mold, and we are going to create our daisy dough. Daisy had a peachy pink bow, as well as shoes. And she had teal colored skirt. She's also wearing gloves, so we'll put white on the hand area. And here I'm mixing white and purple because Daisy actually has this very light purple top. So you can certainly mix up two different colors to get the color that you don't have in your collection. And for everything else, we'll use purple. Okay, let's see if that works. Push it in. Ooh, the excess. Oh, I'm so excited to see how this turned out. Let's open it from the back. I know it kind of looks weird from the back, but hopefully the front looks good. Ta-da! Here's Daisy. Oh, I actually love how it turned out. Do you guys want to do it again? I think we should. And we'll use a slightly different color combination this time. Ready to see our second Daisy Duck creation? Okay, here we go. Oh, ta-da! There she is! Okay, so which one do you like better? The first one, which is this one, or the second one? Both actually look great, but I think I like the colors of this one better. 
Okay, check this one out. I have here some different colors of Play-Doh. I'm going to roll this up. They're kind of meshed into one, just like so. And then here is our bow mold and we are going to just use that in the middle. And voila! Look at that, it's a multicolored bow. Let's do that again. Cut right here. Woohoo, here's another. Both look so cute, don't they? Now we have this Minnie Mouse head mold. For that, I wanna use a pink dough. Press it on. Whoa, we made it pretty thick, didn't we? Take it out. Whoa, here's Minnie Mouse's head. So we made it in pink, but we can also make it in green, yellow, red, or pretty much any other color you want. <laughs> Remember our knife that we used a while ago? This can actually double as an ice cream scooper and we can also use it as molds. We can make a star, a mini mini Mouse head, a heart, and of course, a scoop of ice cream. Here's our yellow star. Here's our multicolored Minnie Mouse head a red heart, and our scoop of ice cream. And lastly, we also have this yellow roller that has some bows and heart designs. Let's try it out. It's upside down, but it still looks cute. Let's do that again. Here we go. Check out those bows and hearts. Now that we have made our Minnie and Daisy doll creations, can we now make them reappear? Almost, Mickey. We just need our magical microwave. There it is. Let's go ahead and open this up. Remember our Daisy Duck doll creation? Let's put it inside. Let's close it up. And here we go. Magic time. Time to enjoy our treat. Yippee. Here is Daisy Duck! Oh, Daisy, Daisy, Daisy! I sure am glad to see you! Now let's get Minnie Mouse back! You got it, Mickey! Here is our Minnie Mouse dough creation. Put that in there. Let's make a treat together! And magic time! enjoyed it too! That certainly was a lot of fun! Thank you besties for watching this video. I will see you again in our next episode, okay? Essie here for Ned and Essie. And remember, stay super! Bye! Now that you guys have disappeared, I think it's my turn! Wizard Ned! I'm ready! <gasps> Uh-oh! It's our turn to get Mickey back!